Hi everybody! Welcome to Storytime! My name is Natalie and I'm the librarian at the Comox branch at Vancouver Island Regional Library. Let's get started today by singing our Roly Poly song. Roly poly, roly poly, up, 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 up. Roly, roly poly, roly, roly poly, down, 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 down. Roly poly, roly poly, out, 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 out. Roly, roly poly, roly, roly poly. In, 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 in. Roly poly, roly poly. Fast, 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 fast. Roly, roly poly, roly, roly poly. Slow, 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 slow. Job. Today we are going to do story time all about kites. Do you know what a kite is? Yeah, it is something. Thing that on a windy day you can run out and it's like a triangle or a diamond shape and it's attached to a string and you can run around and it flies in the air. So much fun to do and so much fun to play with. So we're going to start with by doing a kite poem and it's called Kites in the Wind. Do you think you can help me count how many kites I have? We're going to put them on the screen board here, and I want you to help me count. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. Good job, six kites poem goes like this. Six kites. All are blue. Four flew away. Help me fly the kites away. One, two, three, four. And now there are two. Good counting. <laughs> Two kites are ready to fly. Up they go. One, two. Now wave goodbye. Bye bye. <laughs> Away the kites fly in the wind. Up, up into the sky. That was a poem that was written by Jeanette M. Sweet. Okay, and now I would like to share with you a special Kite Day story. It's called Kite Day, a Bear and Mole Story, and it's written by Will Hillenbrand. Will Hillenbrand, and it's published by Holiday House. So there's Bear and Mole. I think they look pretty excited about going to fly a kite. I wonder what's going to happen when they try to fly a kite. Let's see. I hope you can see the pictures. Bear looked at the sky. Could it be, he wondered? What does he see in the sky? I think, I think he can see and feel the wind. He tilted his head up. Whiff, whiff, whiff. He smiled and then shouted, Kite day! Feel the wind on his nose, couldn't he? Bear rushed home. Huff, puff, huff, puff, huff, puff. I think he's excited. Come on! Bear waved to Mole. Kite day is here! There's Mole there. But he's going to be excited too. Bear collected. Mole. Studied. Bear snatched. Uh oh. I think he glued his foot. What do you think they're making? Are 
are they gonna make a kite? Fair, measured and cut. They're measured and cut. Mole drew and they both constructed. Look, they are building a kite. That looks like such an amazing kite. Finally, they raced outside into the meadow. The kite flew. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Wow, it must be really windy, eh? It soared up, 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 up it goes. And dark, heavy clouds rolled in. Rumble, rumble, rumble. Oh. Uh-oh, it's looking kind of dark and stormy, isn't it? Uh-oh. The breeze grew into a gust, and then, snap, the kite string broke. What is going to happen? Away, 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 spun the kite. Oh no, screamed Mole and Bear. Down, 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 plunged the kite. Oh no, it looks like it's really getting whipped around. Save the kite, shouted Mole. The two ran. Hurry, 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 urged Bear. Hope they don't lose their kite in the storm. Mole stopped. He tilted his head up. Splat, splat, splat. Rain pelted the broken kite. Where do you see the kite? I think it's caught in the tree, isn't it? Look, cried Bear. Oh, sighed Mole. Chirrup, 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 squeaked the, squeaked the chicks. The kite landed right by a baby bird nest. So neat. Thank you, sang the mother bird. Oh, wow, look. The kite landed right in the tree and now it's protecting the baby birds in their nest. Isn't that amazing? So it all worked out after all. The end. There, that's our story for today. I'm glad that there was a happy ending to that because that was a little bit worrying. I love flying kites so much, it's so much fun. And you know what? I felt pretty inspired by looking at Bear and Wolf build their own kite. Do you think you could build a kite at home? Kite is a diamond shape. I bet you could build your own kite at home by cutting out a diamond shape out of a piece of paper and then all you need to do is attach a string to the bottom. You could put stickers on it, or color it with crayons and decorate it, make it look beautiful. And then you could take it outside and fly it yourself in your own yard. You should try that. I love flying kites. I dream about flying kites. Don't you think it'd be so nice to fly a kite in the warm summer breeze down by the ocean, the boats in the marina? You know who would be wonderful kite flyers? My dog, Ruffles. Do you think you can dream with me about flying a kite and maybe learn a couple kite songs while we're at it? I'm a little kite up in the sky. See me flying oh so high. When the wind begins to blow and blow, I'll twirl and twirl, just watch me go. Ruff, ruff. Let's go fly a kite up to the highest height. Let's go fly a kite and send it soaring up through the atmosphere, up where the air is clear. Oh, let's go fly a kite. Ruff, ruff. Wow, that was so wonderful.
wonderful dreaming, my boat, ocean, flying my kite, the do my dog Ruffles. He sure does know how to fly a kite really good. Thank you for coming today. And now we're gonna sing our goodbye song. So we have one friend here, one friend here. Give each other a big hug. It goes like this. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you for coming.